Women have been given an avenue to highlight their achievement and struggles to promote justice and fairness in any country. At a free medical fair in Lagos State, women with disabilities were the focal point to ensure equal accessibility and fairness. We have more in this report. Walking down the red carpets are women with disabilities and some albinos. They are here to receive free medical treatment that may not be easily accessible in their nearest health center. I came across Amara Favor, who has been visually impaired for about eight years. She narrates her struggles and what this treatment will do for her. I had a bike accident at the age of 22. So after that, the vision became low. So in order to improve the sight, I went for a surgery, but unfortunately I lost the sight totally. Sometimes they do push up, it falls down, when they are skilled and other things, people don't mind. But if they can bring out volunteers that can be able to assist people during this kind of program, it will be good. Oh, I love you. Statistics show that at least 25 million people live with disabilities in Nigeria. The organizers say although the National Disability Act was signed into law in 2019, very little has been done regarding implementation. Signing a bill into law is one thing. Its application and interpretation is another thing. And I would use this opportunity to appeal to the government um, to just to tell them that you, it's signed all right, but then its application in organizations, in, the, in applications in our societies, in our communities, is very, very far from what is expected. Um, one of the things government can do, especially in the area of healthcare, is to ensure that in, ho in our hospitals there are sign, sign languages and the interpreters there to help these people with these challenges to be able to communicate with the care providers. So that's one of the things. Their reproductive health is very important. Government can bring them on board on that. Their mental health is also of utmost importance. Bring them in, let them feel that, you know, you go to the West, the buildings are built to accommodate people in wheelchair. You go to any program, there are people that are using sign language. So I think we just have to have a mental paradigm shift to understand that, you know, even though there are people with um, disabilities, the truth is that in every disability there is a great ability. As other women continue to lend their voices, it is a reminder that these women with disabilities also have abilities and skills that are relevant in today's world. In New Luak Bukola, TVC News, Lagos.